to deploy your first exam, first create an exam content area. Go to the plus sign, and then, click content area. Type a name for the exam content area and check off, available to users. Click submit when finished. Reorder the menu if you prefer, and click on your exam content area when finished. Go to assessments, and then click on, test. Select your previously created exam from the list, and then click submit. If you have a description or instructions for your students, check off the boxes that enable them. In step 2, set the Make the Link Available option to Yes. If you want to allow multiple attempts, you can specify the amount of attempts, if not, leave these boxes unchecked. To set a timer for this exam, check the Set Timer box and specify a time limit. To automatically submit the exam for the student once time expires, turn on Auto Submit. You can also set date and time restriction access for the exam. The exam will only be available to your students between the date and time you specify. You can also require a password to access the test. In step 4, you can set a due date for the exam, and also restrict students from starting the exam once the due date passes. In step 6, you can specify what feedback you want to give your students after they have completed your exam. Type of feedback includes the score per question, correct and incorrect answers, and instructor feedback. In step 7, you can change how your test is presented to your students. You can pick between showing all the questions at once, or each question, one at a time. You can prohibit backtracking, which prevents changing an answer once it has been submitted. If you want to randomize the questions for every test attempt, check off the Randomize Questions box. Click Submit when finished. Your exam is now available.